I've just woken up, and all the boredom has come back to me, I've, even after having an exciting evening yesterday, ghost riding the web, so I'm going to have to start, start today with something really exciting, like uh, something you can do in the suburbs. This is almost as dangerous as ghost riding the web. Yeah, is you can just climb your banisters, and it can really be fun. But I'm going to take off my socks first, because they can get very slippy. And I want to have enough traction on these here. Inexperienced climbers tire quickly because they try to pull themselves up with their arms. But I'm an experienced climber and I know that I have to use my feet and leg power for, to hold my, carry myself up here. And, and uh, now, now here I have to make a decision. I can either sidestep like this and take the easy way out, or I can go for jumping over this banister here. I think I'm going to go for the risky one because I'm an experienced climber. And up and over! I made it. Come here, look at this. I'll tell you what, that was not very easy. That was about, I'd say, uh, 50 meters. Uh, or in, uh, in the local measurement, it's, it's probably about uh, 50 million feet. I tell you what, uh, that was a good one, man. It was just a magnificent view. It's beautiful. This is how you, this is how you want to start a morning in the suburbs. It's been a day since I've eaten, so I hopped in my Civic and decided to look for something to eat. Now, what the teenagers here do for nourishment is usually they go to the local fast food restaurant. So, that's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to look for McDonald's. I've had very bad experiences there. The service is bad, food is bad, but when you're really hungry in the suburbs, you don't have much of a choice. As you can see, some uh, hillbillies are in front of us in the Chevrolet. Oh, and here we come to McDonald's. Oh, no, oops, wrong. There we go, right here. Right here, yes. I'm starting to have such a thoughts about this thing. I really, really do not like this place at all. But I'm hungry and I've eaten grubbers before and this shouldn't be too much worse. Here goes. Cool. I'm about to order from McDonald's right here. Excuse me, sir. Is this where I get my food? You take your fucking order? You gonna take your fucking order? Uh, yeah, I'll uh, have a double cheeseburger. So you want a, a, a motherfucker double cheeseburger? Yes, yeah, so I'll have. What this up? is nothing like in, back in the home home country what area. Uh, <laughs> where they make it up, the food, I'm making it all that. But this is the summer. I'll have a double cheeseburger on the double, double cheeseburger. And a, uh, <laughs> a medium strong. A medium spread. And a medium fries, please. You should try the fucking Big Macs, so the Big Macs is good. Uh, I don't like, uh, no. Eventually, the man at the register convinced me to buy chicken nuggets because, according to him, they were some good ass shit. I think that's it. That's it. That's alright. Give me about two minutes because people don't know what the fuck they're doing back there. You know what I'm saying? Two minutes. Three minutes. Maybe even five. If you're lucky, you'll get something down, but you're not. Okay. Thank you, sir. Right now, I th I'm just waiting for my food to arrive. It's just really unpleasant in here. This light right here, it's kind of gyrating and it's really giving me a headache. Uh, it's really giving me a headache and I'm confused. Wait, there is What? There you go. Oh, okay, this is made. Here's the food right here. Yes. Uh, it doesn't. I've seen grubs that look better than this. <laughs> but I'm gonna try it. Here goes. <laughs> It tastes like grease and just crunchy, but when you but when you're hungry like me right now, it's really really good. I'll tell you what, but there's no nourishment in this whatsoever. But I'm really hungry, and at least it's filling my stomach. Alright, well my belly's full now, and uh, oh, look right over there. See that Funplex Fun Park? Now that is not boring. I think 
this may mean the end of my boring journey. It was a great adventure, but very quickly now the suburbs are disappearing as the green movement is making suburbs more scarce and soon there will be no more suburbs to get bored in. So please, you can do things like burning down your local uh, forest or something so that there's more land for the suburbs on Panda Walks. And this was Man vs. Boogie.